Lady Maria. Madame Dantel. That contract is for you. Une épidémie? Something washed up on shore by the town. Those exposed have become violently ill. It's spreading rapidly and there doesn't appear to be a cure. Madame, si c'est juste une mission de sauvetage, je vous conseille plutôt d'envoyer une pupée qui parle anglais. No. This is an assassination contract, Maria. Bien compris. We can't afford any risks, no oversights, no exceptions. Eyes closed? Yep. Ready? Ready. Okay. Hawaii. Honolulu. Good. Uh, Texas. Austin. Good. Um, New York. Easy, Albany. <laughs> okay, one more. Um, how about Wyoming? Cyan? That is correct. Yes. <laughs> Good job. Open your eyes. You're welcome, eh? Hey, take it. It's all yours. Enjoy it, kiddo. You deserve it. Daddy, I think someone's in trouble. What? Are they going to be okay? Uh, well, I, I don't know. Why don't we uh, find a place to turn around and we'll go see if we can help. How's that sound? Hey, uh, is everything all right? Something wrong with your car? Did you blow a gasket or something? No. Impossible. Si il s'agit d'un choix, il y aurait du fuite d'huile. C'est le système d'allumage qui ne fonctionne pas normalement. La voiture fonctionnait bien quand il faisait froid, mais maintenant le contact est défaillant. C'est peut-être la bobine de le manche. Wow! <laughs> so you're a foreigner, right? French, huh? Yeah. You speak any English at all? No. None. Great. Oh, but you can understand me though, right? Oui. Je vous comprends. Yes. Great. Uh, must be scary uh, breaking down in a foreign country and not knowing how to speak the language. Est-ce que je l'ai de Yeah, have you uh, called anyone for help yet? Daddy? Uh, yeah, what is it, sweetheart? Are we gonna help the lady? I, yeah, I'm, I'm working on it. Just give me a minute. Hey, you know what? Let me give you a lift. 
I'll drop it wherever you want to go. You know, I can't just leave you out here stranded with no phone and not able to speak the language. So, um, what do you say? We oui. great, great. Uh, my name's uh, Wait Rider. Right. Uh, what's yours? Maria. Oh, uh, don't worry about your bag. I can, I can get it in here. Yeah, go ahead and just grab the seat. Not a problem. Hey, Pumpkin. This is Maria. She's from France. We're gonna give her a ride, okay? Okay. Right. Yeah, no, I, even though she keeps changing her mind about what she wants to be when she grows up, I know that uh, whatever she does, she's gonna be great at it. Miss Maria, where are you going? Oh, shoot, I completely forgot to ask where you were headed. We should have asked before. Uh, we're headed back to uh, to our house. I, I've got an old map in here somewhere. You can just point to where you're going. And, uh, she says she's going to Sackett's Harbor, Daddy. Wait, how do you know that, sweetheart? Here. Wait, Maria, you can write? Oh, wow, that's going to make things so much easier. Yeah, no, we can totally drop you off at Sackett's Harbor. It's right on the way. Daddy, can I grab some stuff real quick on my backpack? Uh, sure, honey, but make it quick before the light changes. Look! This one's my favorite. Doesn't she look like you? N no. You want anything from inside, Maria? All right, well, we'll be back in a second.
Je m'appelle Maria. C'est un plaisir de faire votre connaissance. Do you want to go on an adventure, Maria? Oui. This is Genevieve. Bonjour, Genevieve. 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 Genevieve! Genevieve is the best dog. But sometimes, she goes missing. Maria! Genevieve has gone missing again. We have to rescue her. Can you help? Oui, Madame Madeleine. You guys having fun? Yep. Maria, tell me if I'm prying, but uh, what brings you all the way out here from France? You on vacation or is this a business trip? She says it's a business trip. Ah, uh, business, huh? I was hoping you were gonna say a vacation. We just had to cut ours short. Yeah, we were having a great time. Sorry, sweetheart. See, Maria, I'm a doctor. I run a private practice back home, and somehow, while we were away, everyone started to get sick. Oh, and my secretary got a hold of me to tell me about how bad things were getting. Well, I knew that I needed to get back as soon as I could to try and help. The closest hospital is over an hour away not doing anything to help. We shouldn't go back to the town. She says it's dangerous. Dangerous? <laughs> well, I don't know about dangerous. I'm sure we'll be okay as long as we take care not to get sick. She's heard about the sickness. And it isn't curable? Well, we don't know that. I mean, I can't just let people suffer if there's something I can do. By the way, um, how do you know about everybody getting sick? I mean, I just heard about it. How did you find out? says it's getting late. We should stop and stay somewhere for the night and go home tomorrow. She says it'd be better for everyone and we can spend more time together. <laughs> uh, I don't think so. I mean, we're, we're almost home as it is, sweetheart, and Sackett's isn't too far away from there. A little while longer in the car isn't gonna hurt anybody. You know what? I'll tell you what we'll do. Maria, how about you come over to our house tomorrow morning, say around 10 o'clock. I'll make pancakes and then you can play with Rosa while I'm tending to the patients. How's that sound? Here, let me write down my address for you and you can just come over. We. Oui.
So I take it the contract is complete then? Oui. Then I take it you had no difficulty disposing of the town folk? single one of them, correct? <laughs> 